Isn't it weird and a bit confronting to see yourself on video? When I started blogging, I really had to work hard on getting past the cringe factor when I watched my own content. And after years of blogging, I'm still cringing a bit. So what's going on? I think we cringe for three reasons. The way we look, the way we sound, and the way we think about ourselves. I think we get put on the back foot a bit by the sudden change of perspective. See what's going on here? I just flipped this image. And when you flip an image, you can see that I'm still the same person. But I'm a bit different now. Because our faces are not symmetrical. So why does this make us cringe? Well, think about when you most often see your face. Which is in the mirror. Our brains have become familiar with a face that we see in the mirror every day, which is flipped the wrong way. So when we see ourselves on video, which is actually how other people see us, our brain immediately goes, hey, I don't look like that. And this creates cognitive dissonance. You experience something that doesn't align with what you think is true and correct. And then there's the way we sound. This also has to do with perspective. We normally hear our voices through our ears and through our skull. But when we see ourselves on video, we suddenly hear our voice only through our ears, which is a bit thinner and higher pitched than we're used to. And then there's self-talk. The way we look at ourselves is determined by many psychological factors. When it comes to presenting, we tend to view others in a more positive light than ourselves, because we mainly judge others by their content. If it's relevant and interesting, it's good enough, even if someone is not a rock star presenter. But when we see ourselves, we don't listen to the content at all. We only judge ourselves by how we look and sound. So we tend to be overly critical. So next time you see a video that you're in, keep in mind that it's all about the shift in perspective. We just can't be objective about ourselves. So we have to counteract and be a bit kinder to ourselves.